Yes! Yes! Nice! I don't think we know what happened to Crawford. More importantly, we got the combination. Krista, are you all right? What's wrong? It's nothing. That was just hard to watch. Don't worry about me. I'm fine. All right. Let's get those meds and get the hell out of here. Hmm. We're in business. Antibiotics, morphine. We take as much of this as we can carry. Okay, I think we're good. This is more than enough for your people and mine. Let's go. You know, I found a third tape in the locker outside. Maybe there's something else on there. We got the meds for Omid. That's all I care about. We'll head back to the classroom. Don't I don't take care what you long. care about, Krista. We're watching the last one. Yeah, Kenny's fine. What's up, Deviant? Listen, as fun as this was, I have to put a stop to this little arrangement. This is the last I can give you. Why? Oberson had someone down here yesterday taking inventory. He's really cracking down. I just can't risk it. We had a deal. Yes, we had a deal. We don't anymore. My sister needs this medicine. It was her sister. Without it, she'll die or... She'll start showing symptoms, and they'll take her away. I can't let that happen. I'm sorry, Molly. I've done all I can, but I have to look out for myself here. Yeah, that's the Crawford way, isn't it? Hmm. Well, shit. That's brutal, man. That's freaking brutal. Oh, man. I think it is. Yeah, I think this one's free on Xbox right now. Jesus Christ! Oh, you scared the shit out of me. Where the fuck have you been? Sightseeing. I'll take that battery down. Oh, yeah. Uh, about that. What? I'm just kidding. That's not okay. Molly, that's not funny. Here you go. What's that? Nothing. You can quit with the act, Molly. I know you're from Crawford. What? Who told you that? I saw you on a security tape. Why'd you lie to me? Oh. I said there were stories about Crawford. I never said that's how I knew about it. I never lied to you, and even if I did, so what? I don't owe her. you anything. You saved my life twice, but you can't tell me the truth? Are we really gonna do this now? I guess that's up to you. I used to live here with my sister. Oh, it was her sister. She was 14 years old. When the dead started walking and Crawford shut itself in, it seemed like a pretty good deal at first. We were safe. We had everything we needed to survive. Then the rules started coming down. No one who couldn't justify their place, earn their keep. No one who required special care. My sister was diabetic, and by Crawford's rules, that made her a liability. I kept it a secret. Kept her safe for as long as I could. But in the end, I couldn't protect her. That's when I got out. Crawford... They always talked about how their system worked. How anything was better than becoming one of them. But I saw what they'd already become. I just wish I could have seen it before it was too late. Before they came and took my sister away. Was her sister pregnant? This is all I have left of her. I didn't have time to take it before I got out of Crawford. I just wanted it, okay? It's okay, Molly. I understand. She's pretty. Oh. What the hell? I 
think that's our cue to get the hell out of here. Spooked by those bells, and ben? then I heard someone coming. What the fuck are you doing out here? Kenny and I still can't get the door open to the armory. He sent me out to look for something we can use to bust it open. I found this. Uh, ben, where did you get that? You I just found it, idiot! It was stuck in the door handle at the end of the hallway back there. Oh no! Ben! Oh, oh my gosh! What a moron! What a moron! Hold, hold still, Molly. Thanks. It wasn't me. Good going, kid. Nice shot. Thanks. Clem. Clem, you beast. You little beast. What the fuck is going on? They're coming. Oh, shit. That ought to hold them. Sir, but now how do we get out? Through the armory. We can just get this damn door open. Ben, Come on, such damn an you. idiot. This is my fault, all my fault. Yes, it is. What the is. Hell is he babbling about? Ben, we talked about this. No, wait. I want to know what he meant. What do you mean this is all your fault? Penny, I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry, man. Kid, this ain't the best time. Whatever you did, save it for later. Fine. Go ahead. Tell him. It's been me all along, putting all of us in danger. Katja and Duck, it was all me. It was all me. Wait a minute. What are you saying? It was me who made the deal with the bandits at the motor inn, slipping them supplies. I thought maybe I could keep them off our backs. When it got discovered, that's when they attacked. And that's when Duck... Oh. Kitty man, I agree with you. You should kick his ass. But now's not the time. Focus on getting out of here! You little pissant! You're fucking dead, you hear me? Dead! My wife and child! You gotta both fucking kill! Kimmy, listen to me. You can whoop this skinny little ass later. But right now, we gotta go! Nice group you got here. <laughs> Not the time, Molly. If this asshole thinks he's getting on my boat after what he did, he's out of his motherfucking mind! Kenny. I know you're upset. I understand. I want him out. But you don't get to make a decision like that on your own. We're all in this together. We're a group. Sure, take a vote. This is America. Fuck it. But before you all decide, there's something you ought to know. The boat's not big enough for all of us. Somebody's got to get left behind. Might as well be this piece of shit right here. Well, I vote we leave him. I'm sorry, Ben. I know you mean well. But all I want to do is get back to Omid, and you put that at risk. That's Wait, true. Don't I get a vote? No. No, you don't. No. <laughs> Sorry. So what's your call, Lee? Does Ben go with No, you? he does not. I'm sorry, Ben. I've got to do what's best for the group. And that means cutting you loose. What about the rest of us? Don't we get a say? No! No! No, absolutely not. Now can we go? Damn right. Vernon, come on! Oh. So much for the armory. What's left of it? A few rounds. That's it. You didn't close that door behind us? I could. The lock was busted. Timberwolf, what's right. up, man? Just fucking great. Come on. There's got to be a way out down here. I'm missing some people. Ah, shut the door, shut the door, shut the door. Fuck! Ah! That's not going to hold. Back upstairs. Wait, look! Yeah, give it to me. Oh, here we go.
Back up, back up, back up, back up, back up. May not have to use all of these rounds. I don't know how many rounds there are, actually. Leave it! Alright, can I get my... Can I try to get my leg free? Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Okay, I got time, I got time, I got time. Come on, man. I don't... Go, go. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Lee, dude! You gotta, you gotta do better than this, man. Oh, shit. My girl. down from there. You didn't come into town from the railroad, did you? Yeah. Why? Never mind. I can see the sewer where we came in from here. What do you I think we can do this. Well, what are we waiting for? Go, go! Why did he ask that? I wonder. Yeah, come on, let's go! <laughs> Krista? Everything okay? Oh, me! That felt good. Krista, don't! Stay back! I never should have left you. I'm so sorry. Krista, get away from him! Mm -hmm. uh, oh, he's alive! Hey. Back already? We got you medicine. Good. I feel like I could use some. Where's Ben? He didn't make it. What happened? Dumb son of a bitch nearly got us all killed. Lee stepped up and did what he had to. That's what happened. Thanks a lot. You did the right thing. Trust me. She'll understand. Man, I hope so. I'm gonna go start work on the boat. Okay. With a little luck, you should start feeling better pretty soon. I'll stay here for a few more hours to check on him. Let me know if you need anything. Thanks, Doc. Yes. Thank you so much. Maybe now's a good time for you and me to have a little talk, in private. Listen, man, about what happened to Brady. Don't beat yourself up over it. It was nothing you could have done. You want to know the worst part? What? I don't feel much. I mean, I don't feel enough. Shouldn't I be broken up over what happened to her? That's how I was when I lost my daughter. When I lost my friends in those first few weeks, but now, it's like I just take something like this in stride. 
like this is what our world is now, and we'd better just get used to it. What did you want to talk to me about? I know you care about Clementine. Anyone can see that. And I know you want what's best for her. But this plan of yours, putting everyone on a boat with no destination, do you really think that's her best chance of finding somewhere where she can be safe? Because I don't. So I want to make you an offer. What kind of an offer? I'll take her off your hands, take her back with me. No! We're well no. supplied, well hidden, and a lot of us have had kids of our own. And now Crawford's fallen, we got nothing left to fear from them. She'll be safe with us. Safer than she will be if she stays with you, I promise you. That's what you want for her, isn't it? To be safe? I'm gonna pretend you didn't say any of this and give you a chance to walk away. Which you ought to do right now. I know you think you're doing what's best for her. And if you were her real father, we wouldn't be having this conversation. But you're not. And staying with you is not what's best for her. If no one else around here will tell you that, then it's because I I'm Ardo. Right, so girls young. and Mark here. We've been through more together than you can imagine. Anyone who tries to get between me and her, anyone, is gonna wind up dead. You hear me? Take your hands off me. Or what, Grandpa? What are you gonna do? somewhere yeah I'm about to head out I, I just wanted to say thanks for everything it's been fun what are you talking about Kenny's working on the boat right now thought you were coming with us God knows you earned it yeah I've been thinking it over it's not for me sounds like it'd be pretty crowded and I never did like the water you sure about what? this? Why should I come up with this? I'm sure. I've always done better on my own, anyhow. Listen, I'm not much for goodbyes. Tell the others for me. Give me a hug. Sure. Come on. You take care of yourself, Molly. You too, Lee. Here we go. I'm sad she's leaving. She's awesome. And you be sure to take care of that little girl. You know she thinks the world of you. Good luck. Ain't nothing to do with luck. He thinks she's got something to hide. Yeah. Hey, sweet pea. Kenny's working on the boat. I know. What are we going to do after he fixes it? Where will we go? Someplace else. Someplace better. Damn, honey. What's wrong? What happened to Ben? What did Kenny mean when he said you did what you had to? Clem, you have to believe me. I tried to save him. Before we leave tomorrow, will we have time to look for my parents? <sighs> I'd like to, Clem. But I don't oh, think tear me up. Time. We really shouldn't stay here any longer. It's not safe.
Clementine? Clementine? Dude. Wow. I think I'm... Oh, no, we're good, we're good. Clementine? Clementine! Oh, God. I should have lied to her. I should have lied to her and told her yes. Hargulies, what's up, man? Thank you so much for the three months of support. Love you long time, dude. Yes, the sub sounds and donation sounds are turned off. Uh, I want to keep the atmosphere of the game going and it's going to be going on YouTube as well so people are going to want to watch it the guy with the radio oh Wait. No. No. Oh, fuck. Lee? Lee? You out here? Lee? Lee got bit? Are you crazy? What are you doing out here? It ain't safe. Lee? Where's Clementine? She's not in her room. Vernon ain't in the house either. What the hell is going on? Whose blood is that? It's a walker's. Fucker jumped me from behind. So where's Clementine? Clementine's gone. I found her having her radio on the ground out here. That's all I found. There's no chance she just wandered off on her own? No. No way. Then who the hell took her? I don't know. Last night, Vernon came to me and offered to take her with him. Said she'd be better off. Son of a bitch. I knew we couldn't trust that fucker. Wherever she is, I have to find her. Clementine's my responsibility. Can't ask any of you to risk your lives over this. This is something I have to do alone. Sorry, partner. No dice. You had my back every step of the way. No way I'm letting you do this alone. I'm sure Krista and Omid feel the same. Lee, I'm sorry. We can't. It's too risky for us. Krista, come on. I know. But Lee's asking us to put our trust in him. And that's just too hard for me. I hope you understand. I really am sorry. I hope you find her. But you're gonna have to do it without us. It's okay. I understand. This wasn't an easy decision, Lee. I want you to know that. You've always been there for me, Lee. Always had my back when it mattered. What kind of friend would I be if I wasn't there for you now? You and Clementine are the only family I got left. I'm with you, to the end. Guess it's just you and me. We should go find Vernon, see if Vernon he's... Vernon freaking What about the man. boat? We can take care of it. Get it out on the water. How long do you want us to wait for you? If we're not back by nightfall, we're not coming back at all. Get the boat out onto open water and don't look back. Good luck. All the food's gone. You notice that? All the food's gone. They're not there, man. Where the hell are they? 
Looks like they got out of here in a hurry. Vernon, get out here! There doesn't have to be any trouble here. All I want is the girl. Give her back and nobody needs to get hurt. I don't know if they, I don't think they stole the boat. Evil Monkey, thank you so much for the sub, man. Sorry, I didn't want to interrupt the story. I really appreciate it. Uh, we do have a website. One of my mods can link it for you. Head on over there and you'll get access to uh, all the sub stuff, man. We've got sub servers and sub TS and, and all of that, man. Oh, it's Clem. Are, are you all right? Where are you? Vernon, you son of a bitch. Cody. Mother. Where have you taken her? This is Vernon, and you should really watch your tone. Clementine's fine, but if I were you, I'd choose my next words very carefully. Oh. <laughs> So intense, man. So intense. The boy in the attic. Did you kill the boy in the attic? You and 74% of players killed him. Hippocratic Oath. Did you lie to or threaten Vernon? You and 66% 66 of players were rational and honest. Um, home alone. Did you bring Clementine with you to Crawford? You and 73% of players brought her from the bell tolls. Did you let Ben fall to his death? You and 33% of players let him go. The bite reveal. Did you reveal your bite to the group? You and 19, 19% of players hid the bite. Wow. Wow. That is so intense, man. Um, oh, this is interesting. Who came with you? So 13% of people had Omid, Lee, Kenny, and Krista. 10% had Ben and Lee? That was it. 12% had uh, Ben, Lee, and Kenny. 16% uh, had Omid, Ben, Lee, Kenny, and Krista. 11% had Omid, Lee, and Krista. 14% had Omid, Ben, Lee, and Krista. 18% had Lee and Kenny. And 6%... 6% had just Lee. That is nuts, man. Ben, we let Ben die. Like I said, man, 